Jekita, as the country's leading tire maker, is pressing ahead with a consolidation and expansion plan aimed at achieving a production capacity of 3.5 crore truck radials by FY18. But that does not mean fresh acquisitions are off the table. CNBC TV 18's Rukmini Rao and Arundhati Ramanan bring us this report. JK Tires is setting a blistering pace and the milestones are flying by. Mergers and acquisitions have been the mainstay of its growth strategy since the late 90s and JK Tires sees no reason to stop now. We have been, as you might have seen from our track records in the last 10 years, every two years we have been uh, adding capacity by acquisition or creating greenfield or brownfield. Mm -hmm. And um, as a part of the strategy, if there is a good asset available, which is a ready-made capacity with a good quality equipment and manufacturing facility, certainly it attracts our attention. This growth through acquisition strategy has paid off. With 12 global manufacturing plants, JK Tire currently produces a whole range of tires ranging from two-wheelers to bus and truck radials. Thanks to the acquisitions, the company hopes to achieve 3.5 million tires per annum capacity in FY18. To push the envelope further, the company is focusing on consolidating its R&D operations. It will soon open an integrated R&D facility in Mysore with an investment of over 100 crore rupees. But it says growth may hit a speed breaker if the dumping of Chinese truck and bus radials continues. It has been growing gradually over the years. Mm -hmm. And now, for the present, nearly 41% of the truck bus radial replacement market are Chinese. And they have grown by nearly 45% YOY last year, their imports. We as an uh, industry have uh, asked for uh, protective duties in terms of anti-dumping. It is if, if critical that uh, government of India acts on it. Critical because given sluggish international demand, India is the most promising market at the moment. With Rukmini Rao in Bengaluru, in Mumbai, Arundhati Ramanan.